Okay, I think we should uh, look at uh, some interesting sticker crafts today, actually. Since it's been a very hot topic lately. So, shout out to Reddit for all of this picture. And to OnlyPixel for some of his audience who's uploaded some of these, actually. First craft I've actually got up here is this one. It's quite interesting. Let's actually see. So, we have two... Oh, we have three, actually. Okay, that's very interesting. So they've called this one the snake leopard coming out of the broken bottle. Yeah, that's a quite interesting sticker. I have to say, it's a very good the uh, theme with the knives as well. It's very cool. And it seems to be quite cheap with a budget of one and a half dollars plus the 8k. So $10 craft for the full skin. It's actually a very good craft for that price. So huge shout out to this guy. The second craft is this one. I don't know where it comes from. The picture is taken from CS Money, but it's a op hyper beast battle scarred with five battle scarred holos on the or scope to make it look like this. Insane looking skin actually. It's really good. And I don't know really how if this is have to be like top tier battle scarred skins for it to look like this or if it goes with any 99 battle scarred but this is insane so definitely if uh, it's not a super rare battle scarred if you have a battle scarred look into making this one this one is insane so this is actually a set of two different crafts that this guy has posted so the first one being with the blue phosphor and the navis going across the top it's a really clean, except he has the PGL uh, flame under it, the Copenhagen flames. So if you would scratch that out, it would be really clean. Insane. And this is the same one with the strike going across. I definitely think this first one looks way better. It's It fits very well with the colors to have it this way. Very Swedish looking skin, definitely approved of this one. The next one I was looking at was this one. It's really subtle, very clean. They've just added to the AK wood here, so it's really clean. Fits very well in with the gun and definitely top tier skin craft for all the clean, non in your face type of the crafts. This is definitely my top five crafts at the moment. Huge, huge shout out to this guy. Wow, this is a really good video. But did you guys know that less than 90% of you guys watching right now have not subscribed yet? Like, look at this. I wouldn't believe it either. But hit the like button, subscribe, and maybe even click the bell to keep watching these uploads. The second one, or second one, the other one I've looked at is this one. This is really interesting to me, actually. So he called it the RGB Titans. So you have, of course, the red, the green, and blue. And this is actually really interesting because I don't know which skin it is under or sticker it is under, but it looks so this or not this. It looks great, actually. It's an interesting craft, I have to say. So he has the old Katowicz Titan, and he has some newer one that he has scraped. Oh yeah, I can see now. It's the F3. Can't remember the name of that team. But this one I'm unsure of which one it is actually it's really a good theme though with the rgb i really like it clean skin so if you have a usp stainless that has a catawich titan on it already definitely look into just adding these stickers just for the fun of it i would definitely do it if i had one it's definitely worth it and of course we can't go a video without the only pixel special if you have actually watched any skin crafts in the last few days you've des definitely seen this one already this skin it's very busy i would say already so i don't think this would be the best place to have or best skin to put this on but only pixel might disagree with me you would probably put this on all the skins if you could so this skin craft on this particular skin i would not do i would probably put it on something less busy but let's move on to the next one this one i saw this is one of the best ones i've seen on all of like the ones i've been looking at today this is so clean but yet quite busy at the same time 
It's really well crafted. They've added... I'm not even sure which sticker that is. I'm not well into the sticker game at the moment. So probably you guys in the comments know and will correct me on this. But it's super clean. At the same time while being quite busy. It's really nice. I just want to want to see how it looks in game. With the hollow and everything. That would look so sick. Next up we have this one. This one's also really clean while it's being uh, quite a little bit busy. So they've added these bullet holes type stickers to a UMP. I'm not even sure the name of this one, but it's really sick. And with the red gloves go coming in as a combo, it matches really well with all the red details of the skin. It's a rather cheap skin craft as well. So if you have red gloves already, Look into this one, definitely worth it in my opinion. Okay. We also have the blue phosphor. Quite bad quality on this first picture, but this picture. It's so clean, insane looking craft. The skin already though is super expensive. So this is, if you own the skin, sure go ahead and do the craft. But actually doing the craft if you don't have the skin, definitely not the recommend. I would probably even maybe if I have the skin, keep it clean myself if I had it, because it's such a clean skin already. So, unless I know how it would look in-game, I would probably not do it myself. But for a craft, altogether, it's a solid craft that's not busy and has a good theme going on. And lastly, we have this one. That man's an imposter! That man is the imposter! You guys might have seen this one already. It's been out for a while, but it's just so... Fun, I would say so we have to talk about it the spider-man deagle and with the combo of the red gloves of course it couldn't even match up anywhere so you have the face of course with the two spiders on the side that's a really interesting craft so I would probably if you have this in fact you're new which is quite rare actually but I think that would be the cleanest way to craft this skin and it's a quite busy so if you have a lot of webbing on the side, it could actually be a downside to the skin or make it even more busy than it would be. So I would probably make this craft if I had few webs and a good float on it. Because otherwise it would be so scratched up and busy like more than it is. So if you have this, good clean, not too many webs, not too low a float. Look into making this craft, because it's really funny actually. So I would probably, out of these, I would rate this one as a top tier. I would rate this one as a top tier as well. This one, top tier, this one would probably be my favorite for the whole theme of the skin. Do you have any other good crafts in mind or that you actually have seen? Or have yourself comment down down the below so I can check them out maybe even make a second video on this because there's so many crafts right now it's insane to keep up but this was just a few that I found within a short while that actually looks quite decent but there's tons more so if you guys actually like this type of content I can definitely make more and go through 